I'm here today to present a Giz mission to talk about fire safety. We talked about what to expect for a fire if it does come through, what we can be doing in the preventative stages before a fire leading up to fire season to, to really get the place in its best shape and how to manage the animals and themselves to keep themselves safe and to keep the animals safe on the property. The steps that we take to prepare our property for fire season is first off looking at the fuel loads that we have, the level of grass in the paddock, slashing it down to manageable levels, having our equipment working and ready to go, vehicles fueled, and our staff knowing the procedure. Our trigger point for activating our fire plan is a severe danger day. So if we know that the next day is going to be a severe fire danger day, we put things in place the night before. We ask staff to come in extra early on those days, and volunteers to come in early. We cancel any extra activities on those days so we can actually have all hands on deck in the event of a fire impacting upon us. My pledge to these animals once they pass through those sanctuary gates that I will never let them down and I'm not going to let a sloppy fire plan do that so it's really important that we have everything in place to um, keep the animals safe, to keep our staff safe and to keep the environment safe.